Your young eyes scan a slaughterhouse, the spider's web, a slaughterhouse to the butterfly. Yours is a world in hunger of God's brush strokes, left bare. Your mouth shapes itself to mock the weight of gravity. You smile, but only until you see breath orphan a butterfly's body in intimate feeling. Everything leaves. You are the last place everything leaves. Sea water has collected on your flesh before, pouring outward. This is how you cleanse yourself, the salt dense as the grey circling you. How young are eyes that are old with grief. Your upper eyelids fall from the hinges below your brows to close, and the world inside you coughs. The trees are negatives. A mob of raindrops fall to wash your wanting away. The rain in her hands tender as the rooms within a mother's love. A simile foreign to you. E kitoro ya busi wabuholo. And in it you are cheery, sharing your wanting with other fruit. Each fruit praying to be claimed by a stem. To call the roots, boughs, branches, and the soft spines of leaves a beloved name. To call a tree, mother or father. You hold the wanting of others. How the palms of funeral shovels hold the soil. The apples blind to which tree they have fallen from offer themselves to death at its altar. No one is nestled on the back of God's beasts. No one is riding with death. Your feet injure the ocean instead. The ripples you leave behind are an ache. For a ripple is just water running away from where it hurts. A ripple is just water running away from itself. The water is forever in motion. It hurts everywhere around.